Hello, welcome to a new episode of Retro Bowl. This is the first English episode and today I am at Aces Vintage in Oslo at Töjen where I got this Rapid Vienna shirt in the first episode. So I'm here with Erminio who Hi. owns this shop. Welcome. Yeah, thank you very much. Welcome back actually. Yeah, thank because you. Because we thank got uh, this... Uh, Little jam here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, and this was uh, the first uh, purchase here. Correct, correct. And also one of the first uh, that you showed in your uh, series, right? That is correct. The first episode Fantastic. of Retro Bowl. So Ooh. this kind of triggered the whole thing in a way. Yeah. So uh, tell me about your shop. Yes, we are uh, here in Toyen. We, as some of you might know, um, yeah, we we try to sell every piece that has an history behind and uh, uh, needs to be vintage and uh, yeah so we always uh, come across uh, football jerseys and football kits um, so it's it's a fun thing that we could meet and yep. have uh, this um, this video together because uh, there's so much to speak about it yeah, yeah. so many features I think that uh, also like uh, yeah <laughs> yeah, so much. Yeah, so <laughs> you have a shop here with a lot of different vintage clothing yeah. and football shirts. Yeah, vintage football shirts. Yes. So you have a lot of shirts you would like to show us today here. You have a stock that came in yeah. uh, from. Uh, this is part. Some some of this was already here. We just uh, have to reorganize and find the right uh, uh, time to go through them. Uh, some came in the last shipment. Yep. As uh, that beauty up there, yeah, uh, tracksuit. Yeah. Uh, um, yeah, that's uh, 1994, if I'm not correct. Please forgive me if I'm <laughs> wrong. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, so we have so many and uh, so many things to details and uh, yeah. things we can go through. So should we just start? Yeah, why not? I, I will start here. Liverpool. Yeah, yeah. Liverpool. So this is from 2006. Yes. Right. I yeah. think you can see it on the design. This yeah. was the Adidas design yeah. in that period. Yeah. It's actually the same period as this Greece uh, tracksuit uh, thing. Yeah. So uh, guess which player I'm thinking about when I see this. Mm. A Norwegian player. Uh, hmm. <laughs> we have to cut it. <laughs> yeah, really? No, no, no. Uh, hold on. Uh, is it Riese? Correct. Yeah. So he okay, played okay. in uh, Liverpool. Yes, yes. And he actually went to Rome. To Rome. Yeah, yeah, yeah so, it's true. Yeah. I remember that. I remember when he went to Italy in Rome. Yep. Uh, but it was after he won Champions League, uh, I think, in uh, that Liverpool. That is true. And I yeah. actually think this was the year that uh, Liverpool played against Milan in Athens when Liverpool oh. lost. I okay. think so. So this yeah. was the away shirt. In that game, in the yes. final, they played with the home shirt and Milan played with the away shirt. Yeah. And Milan won with Inzaghi, I think, scored and Maldini. I'm, yeah. I don't remember. But yeah, it could be. Yeah. Could be. Yeah. So, so, no, I think it's uh, very interesting because I think this might be the third uh, jersey, like the, th uh, the away, but it's they have two aways or? Uh, sometimes. I'm not, yeah. I, I, I know at least this is, must be the away shirt. I yeah. think yeah. so. Yeah. Could be the third. Because it's funny because it, there's no Carlsberg in front. In the oh, also. yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't. I think they had Carlsberg that year, though. Yeah, yeah they do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think this one uh, doesn't have any. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. it's, uh, it's, yeah. Pretty, it's pretty cute, cool. Yeah. Shall we and, move? Yeah. And also, I think, uh, I don't know, like um, the, the logo is in the back, the one. Uh, uh, yeah, the, it's down no, was oh, maybe, it's on yeah, the arm. Yeah. yeah, so yeah. this is like the Adidas. Uh, uh, campaign and that yeah, yeah, that year, yeah, yeah exactly like, like this yeah. was the design mm -hmm. uh, and I think there's a nice little detail on the back here with the uh, mm -hmm. uh, Liverpool imprinted in the yeah the um, the uh, the crest yeah 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 it's really really cool yeah, yeah. cool piece yeah okay uh, I don't remember Spain. the name of the uh, year of this one okay Spain so uh, it's actually from 2010 2010. So this was actually the year that Spain won the World Cup in South Africa. Africa. Yeah. Against the Waka Waka. Thing. Waka Waka, <laughs> Bubusela, uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, Shakira. Yeah, yeah. The so, um, mm -hmm. yeah, they won against the Netherlands in the final there. They played, though, with the blue one in the final. In the final, yeah. yeah because yeah. They, the Dutch have a orange color. Yeah, so, so it would be too alike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, you remember then Iniesta, Andres Iniesta scored the winning goal for mm -hmm. Spain in uh, extra time, I believe. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if I remember. Yeah, you, you, what I think I think I remember that too. What happened with Italy? Did they play? Or? Yeah, but I think it was Spain actually that yeah. um, uh, kicked us out. If I don't recall Spain? wrong, Spain. Yeah, I, I don't remember. <laughs> I think 
Yeah, I think so, but I, I'm not sure. Okay, yeah. Yeah, but I, I, I remember some uh, disappointment and uh, this was maybe the color. So. Yeah, but you won in 2006, so... Yeah, it's that, okay. was, that was a good... Yeah, yeah, that's okay. We can leave with that. Yeah. So let's... So because you, you don't only have football shirts, but you also... Oops, so this will happen a couple of times. Yeah. You don't only have football shirts, but no. you also have these... Yeah, the track jackets. Suits, yeah, track and suits. Jackets and track suits. Yeah. Uh, this is from Brazil. Uh, we should guess the year for this. What would you say? <sighs> really tough yeah, question. Uh, yeah. What can indicate anything here? I I am not sure. I feel it's kind of modern. Or yeah, is it? Can I, if I see the Nike tag, maybe? No, actually, maybe this is uh, mid two thousand. Yeah. Yeah. Or early mid two thousand. Yeah. I would say from the tag. It's in a ni really nice condition. And it's also, oh, this is a nice detail. Oh, here. yeah, wow. Penta Campeão. Uh, I think Penta, uh, Penta Campeão, I mean, I'm Italian, so I can guess a bit, and this is Penta Champion. So okay. it's a uh, five-time champion of the world. Of course it is. Penta, so it's in Greek, five. So yeah, yeah, so it's five stars. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, you and see they're it very proud of it. So yeah, they, I would, you we, can see it course. above the, yeah. yeah. Who wouldn't be proud of yeah. be five times of world champion? Yeah, so yeah, of course. And they won the last time in 2002, which is 20 years ago. Yeah, yeah. With uh, Ronaldo. With Ronaldo, um, Ronaldinho, yeah. Rivaldo. Yeah, wow. Gilberto Silva. Yeah, it was uh, <laughs> Roberto Carlos. Roberto Carlos, yeah, yeah. Cafu. Yeah, Cafu. Uh, um, hmm, a lot else? of uh, more players. <laughs> yeah, Kaká maybe. I don't think. I think he was maybe too was young. Maybe was in the in the he, bench. It could be. I, bench, I don't yeah. think so. No. Oh, okay. My guess is not. Okay. Uh, but Kleberson was playing. Kleberson, if you mm. remember him. No, I'm he, I don't. He played in Brazil at that time. He went to Manu after. But oh, okay. 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 Yeah. No, don't recall that. But okay. Cool. So here we have another interesting piece, which is not a European team. Like you said earlier, this could look like a Real Madrid, but mm -hmm. it is another... What, what team is this? Oh, we have to check that because I remember I, I already searched for it. Uh, mm, my I guess totally is forgot. something with Universidad or... Uh, that's my guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something uh, with that was my first uh, guess as well, but no, that's the team. So here you uh, have... We have a very cool tool here. If I can take a picture of it. Sure. Let's see, let's see. Japan. Uh, Alma, okay. Let's see. It's from so, Latin America for sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's a it's a team from Ecuador. Oh. And uh, it's uh, camis. Uh, no. <laughs> camiseta. Uh, camiseta is a shirt? jersey. Yeah, yeah, shirt or jersey. Yeah. Um, you say camiseta in Italian or maglia or? No, we say maglia. Maglia. Yeah. Okay. I mean it. Yeah. Yeah. We do that. <laughs> but in these Latin-speaking countries, you would say maglia or camiseta. Uh, yeah. I guess. Yeah. 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 How do you say in Greece? Uh, uh, Fanella, way, which is uh, uh, yeah, like a shirt. Yeah, yeah. okay. In so it's Norwegian, closer to camiseta. But you know, you could use in, even in Norwegian, you could say dracht or tröje. Yeah, yeah. So mm. yeah. Okay, so L D U L D U L D U Quito L D U Quito. Okay, L D U Quito. But where did you get this from? These are uh, hand picked in Italy from my brother. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so it's all over Italy and um, markets, uh, contacts that my brother has. Mm. So yeah, it's a, it's a cool process. Yeah, yeah. Would you like to say anything more? About uh, this? No, not, yeah. not necessarily. Okay. Uh, I think it's uh, just cool. Yeah. Uh, Umbro and it's similar to Real Madrid. <laughs> and now we have something from the country we are in right now. Yeah. Norway. Definitely. Yeah, yes. Norway. So this... When is this from? Uh, it's not too old. Mm -hmm. I think I would guess maybe like 2018. 2018? Okay. I, I think yeah. so. Yeah. I'm not sure. Maybe you can uh, figure this out. When yeah. is this from? Yeah. I think I feel like 2018, yeah. maybe or 2016. Yeah. Okay. Some something. <laughs> So number nine on this one. Yes. Who was number nine? Uh, is he Holland already or uh, uh, Poland? Well, now, now I think uh, he, he has number nine. Yeah. But at this the, time, maybe it was um, uh, the guy who were, uh, played in Real Madrid. Uh, uh, the goal? Yeah. No, I don't think no, so. Was he had him? ten. Okay. Uh, uh, Joshua King. I'm not sure. Then this I'm is not something sure. you can figure out. Uh, what year was this shirt from, and uh, who was number nine? Yeah. Yeah. Also, also, it's uh, it's maybe important to say that uh, even if it's not vintage, uh, it might be, 
uh, it, it yeah, will yeah. become. Yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, we still uh, collect some of them uh, because some people just collect them. Yeah, yeah. And uh, it's cool to have yeah. from each year. I collect from both vintage and new now recently. So, yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever is nice. Yeah, <laughs> cool. Okay, nice. so, but now we can move into maybe something that you are particularly interested in because you see here the, uh, he, you support Juventus. Yes, I do. So we have a Juventus shirt okay. here. Uh, yes. So yeah, we have Juventus, you support Juventus, yeah, but do. you are from... Uh, yeah, I'm uh, from Lazio region. Lazio region, um, yeah. Yeah, actually on the border with Campania, so... Uh, geograph geographically, I shouldn't be supporting them, yeah. but uh, Juventus is, uh, is supported all over Italy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, for many reasons, historical and in my case, uh, because my father was from Juventus. Okay. So, yeah. But yeah, you we were talking about this uh, a bit earlier because you were talking about the owners of Juventus, yeah, the yeah. An Agnelli, Agnelli, family, Agnelli family, the yeah. owners of the Fiat Group, like yeah. you see the sponsor. Yeah, they, at this point in time, yeah. Yeah, so yeah. you said that they gave work to Italians. Well, that's, that's the historical reason. Uh, uh, Agnelli family owned, uh, uh, always owned Fiat yeah. and... Uh, uh, obviously, gave a lot of work uh, uh, across the booth of Italy, yeah, yeah. and people were tend to they tend to support the, the team that that family would support. Oh, okay, so that's maybe the historical mm. reason yeah, yeah. behind it. Uh, in my case, my, my, my father was a supporter of Juventus, so it's hard to <laughs> be supporting yeah. something else yeah. if your father is mm. or mom is supporting a certain team. Yeah, mm. so that's uh, the reason behind. Mm. So you see, the, this logo is newer than the one on your jacket yeah, there. Absolutely. Yeah. So we can compare here because Juventus they have changed their logo a couple of times. Recently, three yeah. times. Yeah. Uh, so this times, was yeah. maybe the one that I grew up with, yeah, yeah. and then they changed it to this to one, this which one. is quite similar in yeah, a way. It is. But now they just have the J. The, the J. Yeah. 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 Yeah, it's true. Uh, I grew up with this one as well. Yeah. So for me, this is uh, I feel still like a bit of an upgrade. Yeah. Um, the 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 J, uh, it's really simple. Yeah. Maybe we had the chat before. Yeah. It's probably easier for digital uh, marketing. Yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, and I'm not a fan of uh, yeah co either companies or team changing their logos. Mm. But uh, at the end of the day, it's cool because then you will uh, recognize the era yep. easier. Yep. And uh, there's some that are more attached to one rather than another. So, yeah, I think it's a cool thing. And this is... Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah. No, another thing I would like to add is that the, this is a dead stock piece. Yep. Okay. And this is the year when uh, uh, you, you know, if you don't remember, I guess you remember. Yep. But uh, Juventus went to Serie B in the season 2006. 2006, 2007, and this was from the year after when they regained their, posi the, their yeah, position. They got in, promoted. Promoted yeah. up to Serie A again. Yeah. So, yeah, this is the Phoenix uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. era of mm. uh, Juventus. Mm. Yes. Yeah. Okay, what's, what's up next? Yeah, we have a Barcelona. We're going to have Barcelona. Yep. Barcelona, when is this from? It's, uh, it's quite I'm a bit ignorant yeah, about this. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, but we can uh, figure out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Barcelona, Piqué, Piqué. Mm -hmm. I think he was uh, on the Spanish team that won the uh, yeah. World Cup, I yeah. believe. Yeah. yeah. So Gerald Piqué, he's still playing there? Uh, I, th I guess so. Yeah. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. 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 I believe so. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So yeah, you like this shirt? What do you think about this? Oh, I, th I think uh, Barcelona has been um, really consistent with the. Uh, the overall design, but yep. if you go into the details, you yep. can see the small uh, Change? changes, yep. which is makes it even fun, uh, cooler. Here you have a small little detail. Yep. You probably want to say that. Uh, okay, I, I can try. Yeah. Uh, mass can club. Yeah. So or that club. means more um, than a club. More than a club. Yeah. 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 So you have some. Uh, yeah. So that's one detail. Another detail is maybe the Catalan flag hmm. here. Yeah. If you can uh, see. Yeah, yeah. I think also it's cool that uh, the Liga uh, the LFP. logo. Yeah, it's it's over there. And this is actually uh, made out of. Uh, now they have more vinyl patches. Yeah. While this is uh, another uh, cool. material. Yeah, I mean this has been embroid. Yeah. Uh, and it's an embroidery. Yeah. Um, I I always get fascinated from this because. Oh. Um, uh, might be just my ignorance about it, but at least in Italy, when you got the t-shirt, uh, jersey, uh, you don't have the Serie A yeah. uh, logo 
badge on it. So when I see a badge from the league that they come from, uh, for me it's always uh, okay, so exciting. It, so you, part. so for you, it adds value. For me, yeah, 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 it does. Yeah, yeah, I do, I, I do have some search with the patch on, especially with from, Seria? from, uh, no, not Serie, but from like the World Cups. Oh, okay. like, uh, wow. Yeah, yeah. 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 But they are like um, worn, been worn. No, no, I bought them yeah. with the patch, with or the patch. I bought the patch yeah. after, after because yeah. you can find some people just sell prints and oh, patches. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's yeah. awesome. Yep. Yeah. Let's do okay, it. Okay, so next up now, a club that is has a lot of supporters in Norway. In Norway, Manchester yeah. United. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, so this looks like maybe uh, when to guess. When to uh, guess? I uh, would say. 2011, 2012? Yeah, I think so. I, I think so, yeah. because I think this was not a successful shirt for them. No. I don't think so. No. Uh, was it when Ibrahimovic uh, moved there? I or? think it was before. I before, think, time before. I yeah. think maybe it was when Moyes was the manager. I'm okay. not sure, but this is like... I think it's funnier they to just guess us things. Us. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but this, yeah, what do you think? It's, uh, we have the I color it's here. Pretty neat. Yeah. It's a bit retro yeah. in the design of the... Yeah, pretty Alice. clean. Mm -hmm. And the sponsor is also clean. Yeah, I like Com that. Actually. Yeah, like compared to the Juventus one, that's really... a a sponsor which has different colors yeah. than maybe the rest of the shirt yeah. in a way. So I saw even worse uh, yeah, yeah. examples. I, I have uh, two. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So but uh, this is uh, what I usually appreciate when the, the, the sponsor matches uh, really well the overall uh, colors. aesthetic and mm. its colors. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I think it can be can make history fr from uh, an aesthetic point of view. True, true. Yeah. Like I we have seen with some teams that you feel yeah. like the sponsor is some what attached yeah. to the club yeah absolutely in a way. absolutely yeah. i i totally agree with that yeah 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 then we have another manchester yeah we have another manchester this probably for me looks like a training shirt yeah i think so i think this is not a jersey no. like a match shirt no, I think especially for the logo here it's kind of a bit much yeah i think this is mm. a training shirt yeah. so you have the delivery company dhl yeah 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 it's quite uh, different yeah. from uh, I mean, the color is kind of there, though. Yeah. But uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Well, the color.